Newsy News. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, you beautiful YouTube Tarkovians. My name is OnePeg, and this is an afternoon edition of the Newsy News, where today we have yet another teaser from the folks over at BSG. So this morning I had a video that was about 357, and how BSG buffed the Rhino and its accuracy and was shown a teaser. We were shown a teaser from what I appeared or thought it appeared to look like was Streets. But we also have a video that was shared by BSG uh, just a few 15 minutes ago with one what looks like a hidden message for all of you. So I'm just going to pull up the video and you guys can see it for yourselves. All right. So we got Bear and now we have goddamn Scavs. Scavs here? No way, man. I can't believe Command is up and left us here. Yeah. Got a bad feeling about this. It's like in the goddamn movies. So in case you ended up missing it a little bit, uh, I'm just going to replay it without sound. And you'll notice right up here at the top, the lighthouse is flashing. So we have a little bit of a teaser for Lighthouse. And you can see up in the background, we have the Lighthouse flashing at different intervals. So it turns out that this is actually Morse code. And the message? Well, according to the Twitter user, at Laziest Engineer, it reads, Red Scav High, friend or foe. Now who the Red Scav is, I'm not sure. I really doubt that this is referring to Santa Claus from the Christmas event, but maybe we're going to be introduced to a new person in the lore referred to as Red Scav. It is also possible that the Red Scav could be referring to Tagilla, uh, because Tagilla has an awful lot of red in his outfit and he has the red boss hat, so maybe they're referring to the Red Scav of Tagilla. Uh, maybe Tagilla is going to be visiting the lighthouse in the future, although that seems like a stretch. With Tagilla and the hammer and him primarily using shotguns like the Saiga, I'm not sure if that necessarily makes an awful lot of sense. Maybe they do an event where he's like at the villas or something like that to try and refocus a little bit of, of PvP focal points. I'm not really sure there. Um, I don't think that that's necessarily the case, but it could be. It could be. I guess we'll have to see. Anyway, guys, that's what I have for this video. Thanks so much for coming and checking this out. Thank you to those of you that decided to stop by the stream today. Just as a reminder, I'm live every single day on Twitch from 8 a.m. on to, oh, I don't know, just about whenever. And uh, I try to upload to YouTube just about every other day or so. So if you end up liking my content and you wouldn't mind subbing the channel, I would be very, very appreciative. In the meantime, always you can stop by my Twitter at OnePegMG, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks.